hey what's up guys welcome back to my channel and if you're new here welcome today i'm going to be doing this awesome makeup look dedicated to the day of the dead dia de los muertos celebrated here in the u.s october 31st and all over mexico we remember our past relatives friends putting the altar for them with their favorite foods favorite drinks and the pictures to remember them so i'm going to be doing this awesome collaboration with the beautiful alabad if you haven't already stopped by go ahead and Stop by the description bar below and check out her channel. You won't regret it. She is so much fun. She does so much amazing content, makeup looks, and wig reviews. And she is awesome. So please don't forget to stop by. So here we did two V shapes similar to the ones of a heart. Then above that we did a spider web. It does not have to be perfect as long as you have fun. This part is very important. You must sharpen your pencil that way you get a sharp line. I will be putting this line where I would usually put my contour and then drag it down later on to connect with my mouth. So then we're going to be doing half a spiral and then adding petals to it. Make sure it's the same. It doesn't have to be perfect but Make sure you add the same amount of petals on both sides because then we will put rhinestones in the middle. Now we're going to be grabbing the color Just Kidding from the James Charles makeup palette. And we're going to be adding it between the V shapes that we did in the beginning. Next, we're going to be filling in the petals with that same color. Then we're going to fill in, be filling in the entire lid. It does not have to be perfect, just do as best you can. It was my first time doing a Halloween look. Now we're going to be grabbing the color Spooky and we're going to be wetting the brush. That way we can get as much pigmentation as possible. It's okay. You see that smudge in my face? I will touch it up later. No worries. This is a steel. I got it for $384 at Walmart and you get 1,300 rhinestones in different colors. I love the fact that they come connected so you could keep them connected or separate them. Now, I'm going to be putting them around the eye look and I'm using the green duo eye glue and they work very well as you can see I'm touching up all those areas that I smudged and then I separated them as singles and put them on the petals now I'm going to be grabbing this color from it cosmetics lining up my lips This is an Urban Decay Melted Lips and the color Lady Balls. As you can see, the look is coming together very nice. makeup cream palettes it's beautiful it's inexpensive and i love that it's a dupe to the 12 color flash palette i'm going to be filling in the middle with the black to add some dimension i'm going to be tracing the stitches like i said at the beginning it does not have to be perfect because then you will touch it up and it will come to life here i'm going to be coloring my nose with the same color that i used before you could do it any way you'd like. There's no perfect way. As long as you have fun, 
then you got the best out of it I'm gonna be filling in the spider web with the white to make it pop I had so much fun doing this like in collaboration with Lala Bad. Don't forget to stop by and check out her channel. Thank you for watching. Until next time.